Welcome back to the another video of how to MQTT series. In the last video we discussed what MQTT is, how it works and how it was developed. We also discussed the components of MQTT. If you haven't watched that video, watch that by clicking the link in the description. In this video we will be installing the MQTT broker in Raspberry Pi and use it locally. This is the cheapest broker you can have. You can use Raspberry Pi 4 or Raspberry Pi 0 which is affordable yet powerful. As we discussed in the last video, a broker is the central part of the MQTT network which is responsible for receiving all the messages and then forward the messages to the subscribed devices. The broker is also responsible for deciding which message to send to which devices as it already has the information of devices. That is, devices have already subscribed to different topics. We will be installing the Mosquito Broker, which is an open source message broker that implements the MQTT protocol versions 5.0 and 3.1. If you haven't subscribed High Voltages, do it now and press the bell icon so you can get notification whenever I post a new video. Before starting, you will need to boot SD card to Raspbian OS and plug the card in Raspberry Pi and boot it. Let's get started. I am accessing my Raspberry Pi using VNC Viewer. You can attach a keyboard and a mouse and LCD or you can connect with VNC. After booting it up, open terminal and type sudo apt-get update. That will update your Raspberry Pi. And then type sudo apt install dash y mosquito mosquito dash client. This will install the broker. Now to make it run automatically on boot, type sudo systemctl enable mosquito dot service. We are good to go now. You can check the installation by typing mosquito-v. It will return the version of the broker installed on your Pi. Now let's run the mosquito service on background by typing mosquito-d. Now we can test the broker by subscribing to a topic. So we will open a terminal window and type mosquito underscore sub dash d dash t high voltages high voltages is a topic so now let's publish something on a topic we will open another window and type mosquito underscore pub dash d dash t high voltages dash m hello world in inverted commas hello world in inverted commas is the message when you will press enter you will see the message in the first window So it works. Now let's download MQTT Explorer and access the MQTT broker locally from our laptop. So I will download the MQTT Explorer. You can get the link from the description. And after downloading the MQTT Explorer, open it and enter the credentials. Host will be the IP address of your Raspberry Pi. and port will be 1883 currently the broker is not password protected so we will leave the password and username and we will connect after connecting we will enter the topic name and we will enter the message when we will hit the publish you can see the message on Raspberry Pi. Let's try it again.
Okay, now let's make our broker protected by giving a username and password. We can set the username and password by typing mosquito underscore password dash c password file and we will enter username. I am entering pi and it will ask us for the password and we can enter the password it will ask you to retype the password and your broker is protected now now let's check our broker from our laptop again make sure pi and pc are on the same network and now we can access the mosquito broker using username and password so now we will enter host port username and password and then we will hit connect after connecting we can publish messages so that's it thank you for watching please like share and subscribe for more such videos